We're going to go to Washington now. And that major new change to Obamacare announced by the White House, if you like your health care plan, you can keep it for two more years. ABC's John Carl joins us now with all the details. And John, a big concession here to the law's critics. That's right, George, and this is the latest in a series of changes and delays to that health care law. This one will allow people to keep their insurance policies morning, for everybody. another two years, even if they don't meet the minimum standards set by the health care law. These are policies that the White House has called inadequate, substandard, but by extending them and allowing people to keep those policies, it prevents a situation, George, where hundreds of thousands of Americans could have received cancellation notices later this year, just before the midterm elections. And John, as Robin pointed out, the White House pushing so hard right now to get more people signed up for Obamacare. Where does that stand? Well, you know, the goal they set some time ago was 7 million people to be enrolled. They're not going to meet that goal, virtually impossible. But the White House is quite bullish. They say enrollment has really picked up. There is a big push. They've got another three, almost four weeks, uh, and they think they're going to come pretty close to that goal. They're not going to hit 7 million, though. Okay, John Carl, thanks very much.